So the question is, artists and when you find yourself in a drought. Um, you know, I have always been creative. Actually, I've always knew what I wanted to do with my life. Um, but um, there have been certain circumstances in my life that I have been, I was in the process of creating a massive amount of things for whether it be an organization, whether it be for client, whether it be for myself. And I've hit a point where I was in a desert. Um, and I think that happens not only just in art, but I think that also happens just in life. Um, you have seasons where, um, you know, God may not be speaking. You may be feeling that um, you are in this uh, season of dryness. Um, I began to explore different things at that time. For me, um, I was... I was writing, um, doing a lot of video and doing a lot of graphical design at the time. Um, and I just couldn't do it anymore. I, there, you know, it was just, I was just, everything that I was doing was cliche. And um, I got to a point where I just had to get out of my comfort zone. And I began painting. I went to a hobby store and purchased a canvas and I think about $50 worth of paint and brushes and knives and all kinds of things and I just started throwing stuff at the canvas and slowly what happened over a period of six or seven months of just painting I realized um, and, and through reflection that it was how I was creating that was give, putting me in the drought it was how I was living that was putting me in the drought um, I remember being in a situation where I, I, early morning, sitting in my real comfortable chair at home and kind of just feeling the sense that I was creating for myself and not God. I was creating for the people in the seats or people that would watch a video when I was working in television. Um, I wasn't creating out of the means that I was created to create. At that point in time when I realized that, I began to notice that the faucet slowly started turning on again and uh, a wellspring of creativity came back. But when that happened, um, I began to hoard things, ideas, um, thoughts, because if I would ever go back into a drought, I would be able to be inspired from the time that I was uh, creating. So I think that for me, I think that's my walk when it comes to creativity and drought. But I look at why am I creating, the why and the how behind that, and trying to keep a, a very tight, fine line um, between myself and God, because everything that I create, I want it to be a reflection of God and how he created me to create. 